Today I have a special guest, a local Michigan priest, Jose Emanuel, who has become a viral TikTok sensation as he spreads joy by dancing, singing, and flipping into hearts of his community and even the world. So I'm so happy to be speaking with you. How has it been staying at home affected your work and your daily interactions with your community? First of all, it's been a, a, a blessing and a challenge. A blessing um, because I can still reach out to the people um, through the social media, but it has been a challenge because uh, we cannot have uh, more than 10 people in the building now that we're on social media um, more often than not. I mean, every single day I celebrate mass, or I have, we have our service, but we reach out now to a lot more people. It's not the same. We miss the people so much. When did you make a TikTok and did you even know what TikTok was? I had no idea what TikTok was. I'm not big into technology. I'm barely, I'm barely learning. I'm like medieval when it comes to technology. It all started with the fact that I was trying to reach out to our, our um, preschoolers. So I asked around, I asked my secretary. The suggestion was made to do a TikTok video. And I'm like, what is TikTok? She thought it would be a good idea to make a video, popular video that people, you know, they're dancing to it. I actually use her account because I don't even have an account. Oh, and wow. so what you see mostly on the video, it's me. <laughs> I'm just so spontaneous. <laughs> the Oh Na 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 video that went viral, I just said, okay, let's just choose this setting right here in front of our Lady Guadalupe. I just want to unite our faith with the rest of our lives. So faith and fun can go together. TikTok is a way to connect with the younger audience. Why is it so important for you to connect with the younger generation during this time? They are our present and our future. They cannot be ignored. And they are currently at home. When you have time, your free time, you can be very creative. If I can connect with them, give them hope in this time and let them know that we're here for them. And we're entering into their homes, letting them know that, you know, their lives are valuable. Why do you think people connected with the video so much? I think it's because I'm a priest. <laughs> and they've never seen a priest that is so youthful and joyful and crazy at all at once. Did you ever think that you would become TikTok famous? Because this is crazy and it's only growing. I just opened the account like, what, three weeks ago? So I had a sense that people were watching from all over the world because I started to get messages in Portuguese from Brazil. I'm doing my videos in English and in Spanish. So hopefully anyone who sees it, they can understand. What is the message you want people to receive when they're watching your TikTok videos? I want to help them connect their lives and see their lives in the light of the greater picture. Sorrow doesn't have the last word, but joy does. I hope that I can spark some joy in their lives in the midst of suffering. I think goodness and truth and beauty, it's universal.